Hi guys, so in this video, I will teach you how to change weather location. So if you have this weather app right here, which is pretty default to iPhone because you will always see this weather app right here once you've had a new iPhone. But if you don't have that yet, you can head over to your app store and install it. It is on their iPhone, so it is safe to use. So once you're in there and you have it, just click it. And you can see in here my weather. As you can see in here, this is the place that I'm closest with, and that's the default, you know, um, center of my country. So if you're looking for something specific, what you can do is search for it. So for example, I want to know the weather for New York. So let's search for New York. As you can see here, it is. And then you can see this option right here to add this to your weather app. So let's click this. And as you can see, New York has been added. You can also see the time, and you can also see the clear skies or mostly sunny skies. And as you can see, here is the degree Celsius. And actually, there's there's already this H and L right here. You can also drag it up and down, however you want to sort this. And by clicking these three dots up here. Let's click it. You can change this Celsius to Fahrenheit. You can also edit the list or report an issue. However, if you want to do this as accurately as possible, you can go over to your settings, then scroll all the way down until you can see the weather app. So here it is, just under the Safari. And as you can see in here, you can see the cellular data, language, temperature, privacy, and you can also see here the location. My location right now is set to never, but if I want to see the weather that as accurately as possible, I can choose this while only using the app. So let's click that. And as you can see, a precise location has been added. You can toggle it off or you can also toggle it on. After you've done that, let's head over again to our weather app. And as you can see, it has gave me my location right now and the temperature and weather for that location. So that's it. I hope you learned a lot from this video. Make sure to like and subscribe if you love this kind of contents. Follow for more.